Hello boys and girls. Today we're going to talk about the letter T. Let's look at the letter. That is the lowercase T. Do you remember what sound T makes? T makes the T sound. So I'm going to say some words and every time you hear the T sound, you are going to write the lowercase T. So what you need is you need your little dry erase board and you need your little dry erase marker. I know it's not as big as this one, but you have a small one in your, in your bag that we sent you home from school. So go ahead and pause the video and make sure you have those two things and then come on back and join me. Okay, let's practice writing the letter T to begin with. To write the lowercase t, we do a big line down and then we cross it in the middle. Big line down. Whoops, that one went really crooked. We don't want any crooked t's. Big line down and then we cross it in the middle. That's how we make our lowercase t. So now I'm going to show you, or I'm going to tell you some words. And every time you hear T sound, t, you're going to write that on your board. So let me go ahead and erase mine. That way we can figure out how many T's we make together. Our first word is hat. Hat. Did you hear it? Listen, hat. It's at the very end of that one. Sometimes it's at the beginning, sometimes it's at the end. Hat ends in a T, so we are going to make our lowercase t. Big line down, cross it in the middle. Listen to this next word. Sip. Sip. I don't hear the t sound in that, do you? No. Nope. Listen to this next one. Bat. Bat. Did you hear that t at the end? Bat ends in the T. So make your lowercase t. Big line down. Cross it in the middle. Okay, the next one is kit. Kit. Did you hear that t at the end? Kit ends in a T. Make another T. Big line down. Cross it in the middle. The next one is not. Not. Like I will not do that again. Not. Do you hear that t at the end? That's the T. Not ends in the lowercase t. So we are going to write our t there. Listen to this next word. Sell. Sell. Nope. There is no t in sell. There's not a t sound. Listen to this last one. Pet. I will pet my cat. Pet. Pet ends in a T sound. So go ahead and make your lowercase t. So let's see how many words that we had that ended in a T sound. One, two, three, four, five words ended in that T sound. Did you write five T's on your dry erase board? I hope you did. Okay. Thank you for watching this part of the video. Let me go ahead and erase it because we are not finished yet. You thought we were finished, didn't you? I was trying to trick you. Okay, we are not finished. Now we are going to use our letter cards and we are going to make some words. Ready? Do you remember what letter that is? M. M makes the mmm sound. M. Let's look at this next one. Do you remember what sound the A makes? Ah. 
right now we have mm, ah, mm, ah. ma is not a word. We have to add another letter to make a word. There's our T. We've been talking about T says T. Mm, at. Matt. Matt is that word. Good job. Now we're going to change one letter and it's going to change the whole word. That is our letter from last week. PD the penguin has that letter. Do you remember what letter it is? It's the P and it makes the P sound. So let's sound out sound it out. Ready? P at P at Pat Pat Like I will pat the dog on the head. Or if it was a big letter P, an uppercase P, it could be the boy's name, Pat. Okay, we're going to change one more letter. And it's going to change the entire word. Do you remember what letter this is? Sammy the Snake is our zoophonics character's name. That this is an S. S makes the S sound. So we have S at. Sat. Sat is that letter or that word. Now, let's look what happens when we take sat, the S away and sat. We're going to move the T to the front. Now, instead of at, just by moving the T, we have t, a, ta. So we took the word at, we switched the letters around, we put the T in front. Now we have ta. A whole new sound just by moving the two letters. Ta. And we need to put a letter on the end because now ta is not a word. We have that P there now. P makes the P sound. Ta. Ap. Tap. Tap is our new word. Nice job, boys and girls. I'm going to write a couple sentences. Some of these sentences have our sight words in it that we've been practicing. And some of the words in the sentences are new ones. And we need to sound those out. Okay, are you ready? What's this word? I see. Now this isn't a sight word. This is one we have to sound out because it's a mystery word. And we use our letter sounds and that helps us to figure out what the word is. So let's see. The P makes a P. The A makes A. And the T makes T. P. A. Now I'm going to blend it. Pat. 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 Pat is our word. So now I know the sentence says, I see Pat. Nice job. Let me erase that one. And we're going to do one more sentence. This sentence is going to have four words in it. I have to squeeze my last one in because I was running out of room there. Let's look at this one. Ready? I see the... Everyone read that with me. I see the... And then we have to figure out what this one is. And it's difficult for you guys to see that, isn't it? Let's write, write it down here. 
that should be easier for you to see instead of me trying to squeeze it in at the end. Mm -hmm. Mat. Mat. So let's read the sentence together. Ready? I see the mat. And then I put a little dot there for the period at the end. Nice work, boys and girls. I will see you in another video very soon. Thank you for listening. Have a great rest of your day.